So guys, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to compress your audio file in Adobe Audition. But first, let me tell you what the compressor do to your audio. The compressor gets the low frequency and the high frequency to the same level. So it makes them closer together. And when we do that, it makes our audio sounds much stronger than it actually is. So this is the symbol definition of compression. So I have here a song that I want to boost the sound and make it sound stronger. And to do that, we are going to go to effects, amplitude and compression, and then single band compressor. And we are going to leave the threshold at minus 15 dB. And we are going to go to the ratio. What the ratio does, it lowers the high frequency to match the level of the low frequency. So we are going to leave it at five. And now for the attack and the release, those two things are the speed of the high and low frequency. So if I have the attack on 20, it will lower the high frequency very fast. And if I have it on zero, it will lower the frequency slowly. And we are going to leave it at zero so the audio can be at the same level. And for the release, if I have it on 500, it will make the low frequency get high very fast. But if I have it on 100, it will slowly get high. And the output gain, we are going to leave it at zero. And now let's hear it before the effect. Okay, guys, now let's hear it after the effect. But first, we are going to click apply. And now, as you guys can see, the whole audio is in the same level. So let's hear it after we applied the compressor effect. Indiana, there's a flat. So it sounds much stronger and I really like it. So that is pretty much how you can get the volume at the same level in Adobe Audition. I hope this video was helpful for you. And I would really appreciate if you can smash that like button for me and I will see you in the next video.